Hi, excuse me, can I ask you something? Sure, what do you need? This is my first time in the USA. I just arrived today. Wow, welcome. Where are you from? Thank you. I'm from Brazil. My name is Lucas. What's your name? Nice to meet you, Lucas. I'm Emily. Nice to meet you too, Emily. Can you tell me where I can find a coffee shop around here? Sure. There's one just around the corner. Do you like coffee? Yes, I do. I heard American coffee is different. It can be. Some people like it strongly. That's interesting. I'll try it. So, do you live here in this city? Yes, I've lived here all my life. How long will you stay in the USA? I will stay for one year to study English. That's great. You will learn a lot here. I hope so. Do you have any advice for me? Just talk to people as much as you can. It's the best way to practice your English. Thank you. I will do that. Maybe we can talk again? Of course. You can ask me any time if you need help. That's very kind of you. Thank you, Emily. You're welcome, Lucas. Do you like living in Brazil? Yes, I love it. The weather is always warm. That sounds nice. It gets cold here in the winter. Oh, I've never seen snow. Does it snow a lot here? Sometimes, yes. It's beautiful, but it's also very cold. I'm excited to see snow, but I'm not sure about the cold. Just wear warm clothes and you'll be fine. So, are you staying nearby? Yes, I'm staying with a host family. Oh, that's nice. How is it living with them? They are very kind. They help me with my English, too. That's great. It must be a good way to learn. Yes, I speak English with them every day. You're lucky. Not everyone gets to live with a host family. I feel very lucky. It's helping me a lot. Have you visited any places in the city yet? Not yet, so I haven't seen much. You should visit the park. It's really beautiful. That sounds nice. Do you go there often? Yes, I love going for walks there. I'll have to check it out. Do you know any other places I should visit? You should visit the museum. It's very interesting. I like museums. I'll add that to my list. Have you traveled to other countries before? Yes, I've been to Argentina and Chile. Oh, that's cool. What did you do there? I went sightseeing and visited some friends. That sounds fun. Did you like those places? Yes, they were beautiful but very different from the USA. I bet. Every country has its own style and culture. Exactly. That's why I love traveling. Do you plan to travel to more countries in the future? Yes, I'd love to visit Europe one day. Europe is amazing. I've been to Italy and France. Wow, what was your favorite part of the trip? I love the food and the architecture. Do you like to try new foods when you travel? Yes, I love trying different cuisines. Have you tried American food yet? I tried a burger. 
It was a classic American meal. Do you eat burgers often? Sometimes, but I try to eat healthy. That's important. Do you cook for yourself often? Yes, I like to cook. It helps me eat better. That's great. What's your favorite dish to make? I love making pasta. It's easy and delicious. I love pasta too. Do you think my English is okay? Yes, you're doing really well. Just keep practicing. Do you know any good places to practice my English? Yes, you can join an English conversation group. That's a great idea. Where can I find one? There's one at the local library every Friday. I'll check it out. You'll meet a lot of people. That's perfect. I'm looking forward to it. By the way, how much does a taxi cost here? It depends, but usually around $15 to $20 for a short trip. Oh. That's good to know. I'll need to take a taxi later. Where are you going? I need to go downtown to buy some things. You can take a bus too. It's cheaper, only about two dollars. Really? That's much cheaper than a taxi. Yes, but it can take longer because of all the stops. True. How much should I bring for shopping? Hmm, it depends on what you're buying. Clothes and shoes can be a bit expensive. How much do they usually cost? A nice shirt costs about $30 to $50, and shoes can be $60 to $100. Wow. That's more expensive than in Brazil. Yeah, prices can be high here. Do you plan to buy a lot of things? No, just a few things I need, like clothes and some souvenirs. You might find some cheaper stores downtown. Do you have enough dollars with you? Yes, I exchanged some before I came. Good. It's always better to have some cash, but you can use a card too. Do most places accept cards here? Yes. Almost everywhere takes credit or debit cards. By the way, how much does food cost here? It depends on where you go. A meal at a restaurant can cost about $10 to $20. That's not too bad. How do I get a taxi? Do I just wave my hand? You can do that, or you can use an app like Uber. I've heard of Uber. How does it work here? You just download the app, type in your destination, and it shows you the price before you book. Is it more expensive than a regular taxi? It's cheaper, but it depends on the time and location. That's really helpful. I'll download the app later. Do you have any plans for today, Emily? I might go to the park later. What about you? I'm going to explore downtown. Great. There are a lot of stores downtown. Thanks for your answers. You're welcome, Lucas. I'm happy to help.